How you doing guys? Um, tonight is going to be a very, very easy dinner. Um, I know that I, I have somewhat of a cooking slash wood shop and everything channel, but, um, we're making nachos. And as my daughter used to say, they're ghetto nachos. But I would really like, yeah, my, mm, all right, <laughs> save some cheese. Come on. Um, last time I checked, ghetto nachos, going by ghetto, didn't have refried beans, <laughs> didn't have salsa, didn't have black olives, lettuce, tomatoes, or my charger. <laughs> so, now my question is, if they're ghetto nachos, is that going to be considered the way you make them, or is it going to be considered the amount of money you have to make them? Because quite frankly, I don't mind ghetto a lot of things. I mean, ghetto quesadillas, I'll microwave the crap out of them. But when you have ghetto nachos, I mean, isn't that really just nachos from Friday? I mean, they use the same thing. I mean, they'll give you tomatoes. They give, I mean, we're missing the onion, I understand. But you'll have black olives. You have jalapenos, you have chips, you have cheese. I mean, how can we be ghetto if we're having multiple cheese? Oh, we have sour cream too. <laughs> so, I mean, what makes- nachos supreme. All right, so <laughs> my wife now thinks that we're having ghetto nacho supreme. Yeah, she is, right here. <laughs> dink, dink, dink. So, if, if that's the case, when people say ghetto nachos, is it because of your cost or is it because of the way you make them? I really want people to, you know, comment below. You know, and if the, you know, if it's the first time that you're here, I need you to subscribe. I need you to like, you know, thumbs up. I need you to do all that stuff. You know, little bell, ding, ding, ding. I need you to... Tell me what makes ghetto nachos ghetto nachos. Because I've heard ghetto pizza, ghetto spaghetti. I mean, let's not go back to Honey Boo Boo where it was just, oh, no. you know, noodles and ketchup and butter. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like it. But let me know, you know, knowledge is key. I mean, that is going to be your edge for every day. So come on, guys, let me know. Here we are. I'll put up a pin picture on my Instagram. Once again, edge every day. You know, let me know what you want. Let me know if you think these are ghetto, if they're not ghetto. You know, a little bit of a controversy will never hurt a channel. So, um, let me know. See you later.